Hey everyone, in this video, we'll learn how to create a customer with GST details in Zoho Books. Log into Zoho Books, go to Sales and select Customers. Click the plus button here or the Add New button in the top right corner. You can fill in your customer's details in this page. Select the customer type. This will come into play when you're integrating with Zoho CRM. To know more about this, check the link given in the description below. Enter the primary contact. You can enter the company name here. Then you can choose the customer display name based on the primary contact or the company name. This name will appear in all the transactions you create for this customer. Add other relevant details of your customer, such as their email address, phone number, and website. Now, you'll have to select the GST treatment of your customer. It can be a GST registered business, a business registered under the composition scheme in GST, an unregistered business, a consumer, an overseas customer, or a customer who is outside India, a business that is located in a special economic zone or an SEC, or a business that is an SEC developer itself. And finally, a deemed export for supply of goods, which are considered to be an export, but the supply takes place within India. In this video, we'll assume that the customer is registered for GST, then enter the GST identification number or the GST IN of your customer here. You can click Get Taxpayer Details to get the customer's GST details from the GSTN. You can view the GST details and choose to include this name as their contact display name by marking this box. The place of supply will be auto-populated based on the first two digits of your customer's GST IN. Choose the tax preference, that is, your customer can be taxable or tax exempt. If the customer is exempted from tax, enter the exemption reason here. The currency will be Indian rupees by default. Select the payment terms for your customer, that is, the period within which you wish to be paid by this customer. For example, due on receipt would mean that the customer would have to pay you on the same day, and net 15 would mean that the customer would have to pay you 15 days from the date of the invoice. If you wish to enable client portal access for this customer, click here. Please note that you have to provide an email address in order to enable portal access. Then select the portal language. You can also enter your customer's Facebook and Twitter profiles. Now, go to address and enter their billing and shipping addresses. If the shipping address is same as the billing address, click here. You can also add contact persons for this customer. Go to contact persons and enter the contact persons for this customer. If you collect additional details for your customers, you can create them as custom fields. Go to settings, preferences, Customers and Vendors and select Field Customization and create custom fields. Any custom fields that you create here will reflect in the Custom Fields section when you are creating a customer. In this section, you can associate reporting tags for your customers which you can add by going to Settings and selecting Reporting Tags. To know more about reporting tags, you can check the link in the description below. In the Remarks section, you can add any notes about your customer for internal use. After you've entered all the necessary details, click Save. And this is how you create a customer with GSD details in Zoho Books. If you have any queries, you can write to us at support.india at the rate zohobooks.com. Thank you.